Hi. Welcome to Love and Forever Evolving, where we are always and forever evolving. Hello, Geminis. Welcome back, my loves. Welcome to your love reading. I hope all has been well, Gems. Hope you've been taking care of yourselves. And shout out to the beautiful Soul Tribe. I appreciate each and every one of you all. Thank you so much, Soul Family, for your continuous love and support. Your love never goes unnoticed on this platform. It is truly an honor and a pleasure to have each and every one of you all. And thank you, most importantly, for allowing me, Soul Tribe, to assist you a part of your spiritual journeys here right along with me as well. All right. Welcome, welcome. Come on in, Gems, as well to the ones that are new here. Thank you all so much for your comments and your feedback down below. I see you, I hear you, and most importantly, I appreciate you. Thank you so much. That means a lot to me, all right? So welcome in, come on in, smash that big fat thumbs up, show my spirit team some love for the deliverance of the messages here today. I'm so excited to get into the energies regarding your reading to see what's coming forward towards you, Gems. Yes, hit that big fat thumbs up, show my spirit team some love, all right? And if you're new here again, welcome. Subscribe, my loves. We would love to have you, Gems, a part of our soul family. Be sure to subscribe. And if you're new here, adjust your notification bell, Gems, for when I go live on this platform. Yes, I do go live just about every day for all Zodiac sign readings, okay? So if you would love to stop by, get a check-in before you get your day started, definitely be sure to adjust your notification bell so you don't miss out on any new content that I post on this channel. I also go live for questions as well. If you have a question that you would love to ask Tarot through the assistance of myself and my spirit team, we would love to assist you, all right? We definitely have a good time there as well. And if you just enjoy the way that I read my cards here and it resonates for you where you can understand, then definitely come on over. I would love to assist you if you have a particular question that you would love to ask. I'm always pre-scheduling my live streams so that way you can be aware before I go live to get that notification bell to either listen in on the all signs reading or have that question answered for yourself to bring clarity. All right. So no further ado, gems. Let's go ahead and dive in. Let's see about the person here that's on your mind. Okay. Wow, we have here the Eight of Pentacles. We have Earth Elements here, Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo energy, okay? Some of y'all, this person may be an Earth sign here, all right? This is someone that definitely is wanting to apply themselves, I feel like, gems, towards this relationship or connection here with you. This is someone who actually wants to put in the hard work, the skills that it's going to take to have a solid relationship or build off of a solid foundation for you and this person, okay? Okay, wow. Again, this could be a Taurus here, Gems. I'm also hearing a Cancer. Some of y'all, this person could be a Cancer here, a Pisces or a Scorpio. But I want to say here that this could be a Taurus, a Virgo or a Capricorn. So I'm sure those other Zodiac signs was for someone as well. Okay, so let's see what it is that this person wants to work towards here exactly with the Eight of Pentacles energy. I love how they're already showing up, actually wanting to put in the effort and the time time in the relationship here okay so i love that that's already a plus for me okay let's see what else about this person here that's on your mind wow we got the eight of wands we got some good news coming in here towards you as well this is going to be something very quickly and for some of y'all very unexpectedly of this information here that you are going to be receiving from this person here okay uh some of y'all this person here may be at a distance from you they may plan on traveling towards you you may get some news that this person is going to come into town. Um, they may take a, pl a flight, excuse me, to come towards you. Um, this could be someone that's in another city. They could be in another state from you. They could be in another location or area or even country for some of you all, okay? Or they could even be overseas, but you definitely got some communication here that's coming in very quickly, okay? And I feel like for some of you all, once this person comes face-to-face -face or contact to contact with you, uh, it's going to pick up very quickly between you this connection here because I feel like this person is a very determined energy here right and they know what they want okay and they see these values or qualities here gems I feel like in you all right others of you all this person could be a fire sign here with the eight of wands this could be a Sagittarius a Leo or an Aries here as well okay wow so let's see what the potential outcome for you 
this person here is. And we're going to clarify the Eight of Wands to get more clarity on what that news is, okay? We got the Two of Wands here. Yeah, this person has decided to make a decision, all right? Whatever this decision here is, I feel like it's wanting to be given to you in a positive way with a positive opportunity with it. Something, again, that this person has been working on. They could be working on saving up their money to come and build an establishment with you or wanting to move in with you, saving money to one day purchase a new home together or some type of commitment here where this person wants to exchange, uh, exchange excuse me, energies with you, Gems, on some level, shape, or form here, okay? The Two of Wands also talks about, again, making plans, success, finding that control of security with vision and travel a lot of travel energy here some y'all this person may travel for work so they may are getting an opportunity to come in the location that you're at and wanted to communicate with you and discuss some of these things here i feel like that this person has been working on where they may want to take things to the next level here with you for some of you all gems wow oh my goodness if this is resonating for you so far gems again hit that big fat thumbs up all right, show my spirit team some love for the deliverance of the messages here so far. I'm loving the messages here. Now, let's see here at the bottom of the deck here, we have, now that's your element or energy here, gems. This is a two of swords, okay? The two of swords, it talks about decisions, waiting, kind of making sure to see and feel like what you're wanting to go forward here with this person. I feel like gems. You're kind of waiting to see what those results may be for this person or what is the communication, the outcome going to come end up with, right? Some of y'all, you may be kind of guarding yourselves a little bit because you don't know everything. You don't have all the details and information that you may need to know or have about this person at this time. So I do see you being mindful as far as how much energy you give out to this person here for some of you all. All right, so let's kind of get more clarity here with that eight of ones. Let's see what is this news or communication here that's coming in all right wow again smash that like button loves if the messages here is resonating for you so far clarify the eight of ones here for my gems please why do we have the eight of ones here what is this information and news that is coming towards my twinkies clarify the eight of ones here spirit guys thank you so much for the downloads clarify the eight of ones why do we have the eight of ones here for the person that is on gems mind here please Again, this could be an earth sign or a fire sign here. We also have Aquarius energy here as well, okay? So this person here could be Aquarius here. This card also talks about um, healing, okay? Coming to a space of energy where they've been able to overcome whatever obstacles or challenges that maybe they had to, again, work through here and put some hard work and effort in the past. And I feel like they're wanting to come and communicate with you, tell you maybe where they're at on their timeline right now and where they're at when it comes to everything that they have to evolve from and become a better version of themselves, okay? Yeah. And because of that, this person now wants to take a leap of faith here, I feel like, Gemini, with you, okay? Some of y'all, this person here could also be in Aries here, okay? We know the full card talks about new beginnings, okay? Wanting to, again, establish a new cycle and opportunity with you is why this person, again, is reaching out to you with communication here. Because like I said, once you two, I feel like, come to a common ground or some type of agreement here, I feel like things are going to pick up very fast between you two, okay? Okay. Yeah, look at that. We got the Wheel of Fortune. Now, this is Sagittarius energy here as well, Gems. We know the Sagittarius energy or the Jupiter energy here brings in good luck, okay? So, there is something here that whatever you made good deeds with here in the past and vice versa, this person because of the effort that they may have put in or whatever situation they may took a stand and held themselves accountable for or took actions to their responsibilities, this time and opportunity, I feel like, is now now being granted to this person here that's on your mind and this is why they're coming towards you now all right because whatever deed that they paid or whatever deed was due for them to pay or admit because of some type of situation it looks like some good karma is coming back around to this person where it's now giving them an opportunity to open up a doorway here to come towards you maybe this person is even wanting to make amends with some of you all maybe they're wanting you to be aware that they're holding themselves accountable for the choices that they made between you and this relationship or connection here in the past all right whatever that may have been for each and every one of you 
you are, I'm sure is different, of course. But whatever transpired between you two in the past, this person wants to come in and give amends to that. And it looks like the universe here is allowing this situation here to work out in your favor. Yeah, look at that. There goes the judgment energy here. The universe, again, stepping in and assisting this person here. I feel like whatever this person may have done that they wasn't happy with or about themselves, they began to become a problem or an issue in the relationship due to whatever behavior patterns that this person had in the past. This is why they had to have their inner calling to put whatever situation, circumstance, or gems that this was, they finally put it to an end because of all that hard work, because of working on themselves physically, working on themselves spiritually. This is the results that they got out of that with that star card here is healing beneficial to this person not only for the connection here with you but for themselves so they can evolve and become a better version of themselves okay wow i love it i love it i love it so let's see and clarify the two of ones here with the decision here that now is being made now that we now got all the details and the insight here again if this definitely resonated for you providing you clarity and even confirmation for some of you all for maybe experiencing this really intense reading here at this very moment okay definitely smash that like button and show my spirit team some love let's clarify that two of ones energy here for you gems thank you spirit guys yeah look at that we got the five of pentacles here earth elements here again some of y'all this person could be a taurus a capricorn or a virgo here we know the five of pentacles also talks about a loss or someone that may have experienced some hard times i feel like this person here that's on your mind they definitely went through some obstacles and some challenges here where they may have to also take a financial loss because of the choices that they made and it may have impacted and affected their connection and not only that the relationship financial that they had with you all right yes yeah, spirit said that's the truth come through spirit all right some of y'all this person here could be an air sign here as well gems this could be a libra here a gemini like yourself or a aquarius here okay but this is duffy i feel like this person making this decision because they want to be honest with you they want to just lay everything out to you and let you know what they had their experience here excuse me may has been like as you two may have been separated from each other, okay? Yeah, we have the Hermit card here, Virgo energy here. Some of y'all, this person here may be a Virgo, but we know this card talks about isolating yourself from people, from situations to not distract you so you can go in that inner calling with this judgment card here and recognize your behavior patterns. I feel like this person here was able now to see themselves in the mirror. Maybe they didn't like what they seen here, I'm sure, but they made sure to take responsibility for that by by stepping into this hermit energy and they gain wisdom all right they was able to withdraw from addictions or things that again affected their relationship here is why they're now being the way that they are now they're coming out as a seeker and a teacher at the same time because they now can pass on their experience here with someone else i'm sure all right wow jibs oh my goodness so let's now see by using my raw tarot index cards here let's see what is this person's future actions now that we kind of got some insight again on their perspective on their energy and most importantly how they feel about you let's see what future actions do they plan on taking towards you jills and this connection okay wow again definitely if the reading here today has resonated for you hit that big fat thumbs up all right if you would love to book a personal reading as well gems my email details is down below in the description box if you would love to kind of get more insight when it comes to your personal circumstance and what you feel like is the next necessary steps to take i'll be glad to assist you to kind of see what the potential outcome for you and this person here is i'll be glad to help all right my email details is down below in the description box if you would love to book a personal reading okay so let's see what they want to say let's see what are their future actions here towards you in the future all right wow yes spirit is on point look at that we just mentioned here with that star card energy again some of y'all this person could be aquarius here i mentioned that this person was on a journey of healing we got i'm healing for you come through spirit is right on point here so like i said this person has now made the necessary steps they've held themselves accountable and this is what i feel like this person wants to communicate everything to you about where they may be been at what they may been up to what they been doing they want to lay everything out and allow you to kind of see 
their perspective on the journey that they went on to kind of put them in the position and the phase of life that they're in right now and how they just want you to see them as a person now. They're definitely not showing up looking the same or acting the same or even responding the same here, honestly, Gems, as they were in the past. Some of y'all, this may shock you or even throw you off guard here, just how they are presenting themselves to you once you maybe meet up with this person in person here. Yeah, and then we got, I will treat you right. Yeah, this person here they are so definite or they are so you know <laughs> i would say determined here to make sure that they treat you right this go around if this is someone from your past or even if this is someone new because of their own obstacles and challenges that they've learned they are definitely taking consideration the next relationship or commitment that they get in they're being mindful um they have enough wisdom here that they gain from their past experiences to understand real from genuine energy from fake from real you know so i feel like this person is taking all all of that in consideration when it comes to manifesting a new foundation a new relationship a new opportunity for themselves okay oh my goodness all right yes i love it i love it yeah look at that so much so that they're making it known that they're going to tell the truth i feel like again they want to be honest with you and if it takes them having to ghost everybody for you they're certainly going to do just that gems okay Wow, Gems, what a very insightful reading today. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love seeing the spiritual growth. I love the overall outcome and results of this energy here. All right. Again, definitely, if it has certainly resonated for you today, again, smash that big fat thumbs up. Show my spirit team some love for the deliverance here, the messages. And again, if you would love to book a personal reading, Gems, my email is down below. If you certainly do enjoy my raw tarot index cards, come on over to my OnlyFans page where I do energy check-ins every day for the zodiac signs that I post here on YouTube. You'll be the first to get an energy check-in where I only use my index cards to kind of get a feel of what the reading is going to be about before I actually post it here on YouTube, all right? And if you absolutely would love more content from me, come on over to my Patreon family that is where I do have more opportunities where I go live privately behind scenes with my Patreon family. I also provide them free questions every time that I go live, all right? We definitely have a good time over there evolving and they also get early access to all my readings that I post around YouTube. They get a day in advance on all my readings. They also get weekly astrology reports to be aware of what's going on out in the universe and how to be aware when it comes to their own livelihood and their own spiritual path. All right. So definitely if that's something that you're interested in, we would love to have you a part of our soul family. And I look forward to meeting each and every one of you all, Gems. Thank you so much again. Be sure to adjust your notification bell so you can join me when I go live as well, Gems. Thank you so, Tribe. I appreciate you. And I wish you and this person the best, Gems. I truly do. You all take care. Bye-bye.